the the ego, put everything on the on the team. That's for me that's the most satisfying thing of tonight, honestly. The the guys up front, Mason, uh Team Kai, Christian, where he came on, uh, you know, the the work they they did for the team is is incredible, and and I'm so pleased because when we had to suffer, we step up as a group, as a team, and of course uh, we want to build on that, and we want to make special things, and and you know we will celebrate tonight, a few days, few summer, you know, the ones that they don't have the Euros, I'm sure, but after this, you know, that's go that's gone. Uh, we are part of the history, second time in in the history of Chelsea, and then we will go for the next challenge. Nizar Kinsella, go to come. Hi, Nizar, can you hear me? Yeah. Congratulations. Um, I just wanted to ask you, you know, how does it feel to lift this trophy as a captain? Um, it must be massive, you know, just to wear that armband and and get that trophy lift as well. How much does it mean to be in that position as the leader? As I said before, uh, yesterday, I was proud to de to lead the team out, but uh, I wish to be prouder. And you know, uh, of course, uh, you know, to be there to to to, to lift the trophy, to lead the team, the club, uh, it's, it's it's amazing uh, after nine seasons to to get this chance. You know, uh, thank you to to my whole uh, to the teammates, the staff, the club, everybody. You know, to the, for me to be able to to have this moment is is incredible, and you know, uh, lots of emotions coming through during the day was very emotional, and uh, you know, we got over the line, and of course, I'm very very happy. John Murray, BBC Radio Five Live. Hi, Cesar. Hello. Many congratulations. Do you, Do you think that losing the FA Cup final just a fortnight ago in the in the manner that you did served as a, a as an extra motivation. Losing a final, of course, it hurts a lot. And, uh, you know, I wish we could have won both, the FA Cup and the Champions League. But, uh, you know, we didn't. And, of course, we take uh, we took this energy and this feeling, you know, we, we, we suffered 15 days ago, what it means to lose a final. And it hurts. And, you know, you don't want to be in the, los in the losing side. For me as well, you know, to be... My first trophy as a captain is something really special that it took three finals and you know the fourth uh, was the right one and the big one so um, I'm so happy and and of course uh, very pleased as I said before from from everybody because a few months ago lots of of people doubt about the about the, the quality of the team and we created a, a special bond and, and we did it. Okay, and then final question, Martin Samuel. Hi, Cesar. It's um, a straightforward question, really. Is there a better player in his position in the world at the moment than N'Golo Kante? Straightforward? No. Yeah, enough. <laughs> Could you tell us what he does? Tell us what he does for your team. He does. He does everything. Uh, you know, the energy he brings. Um, you know, I don't know how many ball recoveries had today. And, you know, the way he, he drives the, fo the ball forward, he covers so so much ground. It's special to have him. And, of course, when we didn't have him, we, we missed him. Uh, but, you know, I think for him as well, after winning the World Cup, winning the Champions League, and so humble as a person... Uh, I'm so happy. I'm so happy for him. He's a massive part of of this team uh, after a few years. So I'm very happy to have him uh, next to me. Okay. We'll leave Thank you. There. Thank you, everyone. Thank you very much.